Hi, I'm Robert Riley, and I'll be reading for the part of Vincent. Hi, I'm Mac Nolan, and I'll be reading for the part of Jules. Okay. Okay, now tell me about the hash bars. So, what you want to know? Well, hash is legal there, right? Yeah, it's legal, but it's not like 100% legal. I mean, you could walk in a restaurant, roll a joint, and start puffing away, but you're only supposed to smoke in your home or certain designated places. Those are hash bars? Yeah, it breaks down like this. It's legal to buy it, it's legal to own it, <clears throat> and if you're a proprietor of a hash bar, it's legal to sell it. It's legal to carry it, um, which doesn't really matter, because you get a load of this. If the cops stop you, it's illegal for them to search you. Searching you is a right that the cops don't have in Amsterdam. I did it, man. I'm fucking going. That's all there is to it. Yeah, you'll dig at the boast. But you know what the funniest thing about Europe is? What? It's the little differences. <clears throat> a lot of the same shit we got here, they got there. But they're a little different. Exactly. <clears throat> well, in Amsterdam, you can buy beer in the movie theater, and I don't mean the paper cup either. They give you, like, glasses of beer, like in the bar. In Paris, you can buy beer at McDonald's. Also, you know, they call it a quarter pound of cheese. They don't call it a quarter pound of cheese? Nah, they got the metric system in there. They wouldn't know what the fuck quarter pounder is. What'd they call it? A royale with cheese. Royale with cheese. What they call it, Big Mac? Big Mac's Big Mac. They just call it Le Big Mac. Le Big Mac. What they call it, Whopper? Oh. I don't know. I didn't go to Burger King. And quiet in the house, please. <clears throat> quiet in the house. And rub slate again in action. Hi, I'm Robert Riley, and I'll be uh, reading for the role of Jules. My name is Aaron Razor, and I'll be reading for Vincent. Okay. You know what the funniest thing about Europe is? What? It's the little differences. A lot of the same shit we got here, they got there. But over there, it's just a little different. Example? Like in Amsterdam. You can buy a beer in a movie theater. And I'm not talking about some paper cup. No, they give it to you in a glass, like at a bar. And in Paris, you can buy a beer in McDonald's. And also, you know what they call a quarter pounder with cheese in Paris? They don't call it a quarter pounder with cheese? No, they got the fucking metric system. They don't know what a quarter pounder is. What they call it? A royale with cheese. Royale with cheese. What do they call Big Mac? Well, Big Mac's a Big Mac, but they call it Lay. What do they call Wop? I don't know. I didn't go into a Burger King. But you know what they put on their french fries in Holland instead of ketchup? What? Mayonnaise. God damn. Wow. I've seen them do it. And I don't mean like a little bit on the edge of the plate. Like they drench the fuckers in it. <laughs> we should have brought shotguns for this kind of deal. How many people are up there? Three or four. So there could potentially be five. It's possible. Yeah, we should have brought some fucking shotguns. Okay. Rolling. Speed. Action. <laughs> you, 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 you know what the funniest thing about Europe is? <laughs> what? It's, it's like, it's the little differences. <laughs> A lot of the same shit we have here. They got, they got there. But what they got there is just a little different. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, in Amsterdam, you can buy a beer in a movie theater, but, and I'm not talking about no, like paper cup or anything, like a beer, like in a glass, like at a bar. <laughs> and, and in Paris, you can buy one at, <laughs> you can buy a beer at a McDonald's. <laughs> and you know what they call? <laughs>
<laughs> you know what they call a fucking quarter pounder with cheese in Paris? <laughs> you know what they call a quarter pounder with cheese? <laughs> nah, nah, they got the fucking metric system of it. <laughs> they don't know what a quarter pounder is. <laughs> What do, they, what do they call it? A royale with cheese. <laughs> royale with cheese. <laughs> what do they call a Big Mac? <laughs> well, Big Mac's a Big Mac. But they call it a filet Big Mac. <laughs> <laughs> what do they call a Whopper? <laughs> I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I can go to a Burger King. Oh, but you know what they put on the french fries instead of ketchup? What? Mayonnaise. Oh. God. <laughs> I see yeah. them do it. <laughs> Just like, oh, I'm not talking about like a little bit on the plate. Like they drench the fuckers in it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Cut. Rolling speed actions. Hi, I'm Mariana Brer and I'll be playing Jules. Hi, I'm Mac Nolan, and I'll be playing Vincent. <clears throat> I've just been sitting here thinking. About what? The miracle we witnessed. The miracle you witnessed. I witnessed a freaking curse. Do you know what a miracle is? An act of God. What's an act of God? I guess it's when God makes the impossible possible. And I'm sorry, Jules, but I don't think what happened this morning qualifies. Don't you see, Vince? That shit don't matter! You're judging this thing the wrong way. It's not about what it could be. God stopped the bullets. He changed Coke into Pepsi. He found my fucking key cards. Key card. Car keys. What is significant is I felt God's touch. God got involved. But why? That's what's fucking with me. I don't know why, but I can't go back to sleep. Are you serious? You're really gonna quit? Life? Most definitely. Cut. Speed. Action. I've just been sitting here thinking. About what? The miracle we witnessed. The miracle you witnessed. I witnessed a freak occurrence. Do you know what a miracle is? An act of God. What's an act of God? I guess it's when God makes the, the impossible possible. And I'm sorry, Jules, but I don't think what happened this morning qualifies. Don't you see, Vince? That shit don't matter! You're judging this thing the wrong way. It's not about what it could be. God stopped the bullets. He changed Coke into Pepsi. He found my fucking key cards. What is significant <laughs> is I felt God's touch. God got involved. But why? That's what's fucking with me. I don't know why. But I can't go back to sleep. So you're serious? You're really gonna quit? Life? Most definitely. Going speed sleep first. Hi, I'm Olivia Cole, and I'll be reading for Jules. Hi, I'm Mac Nolan, and I'll be reading for Vincent. <clears throat> Thanks a bunch. Want sausage? No, I don't eat pork. Are you Jewish? I ain't Jewish, man. I just don't dig on swine. Why not? They're filthy animals. I don't eat filthy animals. Sausage tastes good. Pork chops are good. <clears throat> a sewer rat may taste like pumpkin pie. I'll never know, because even if I, it did, I wouldn't eat the filthy pig. Pigs, uh, I wouldn't eat it. I would eat the filthy... Pigs sleep in, uh, sleep in root and feces. That's a filthy animal. I don't want to eat nothing that ain't got it's enough sense to disregard its own feces. How about dogs? Dogs eat their own feces. I don't eat dog either. Yes, but do you consider a dog to be a filthy animal? I wouldn't go so far as to call a dog filthy, but they're definitely dirty. Dogs got a personality, and personality goes a long way. So, by that rationale, if a pig had a better personality, he ceases to be a filthy animal. We'd have to be talking about one charming pig. It'd have to be the Cary Grant of pigs. <laughs> Sorry.
Let's cut. Going speed action. Thanks a bunch. Want a sausage? Nah, I don't eat pork. Are you Jewish? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't. I. I ain't Jewish, man. I don't dig on swine. Why not? They are filthy animals. I don't eat filthy animals. Sausages taste good. <laughs> Pork chops taste good. A sewer rat may taste like pumpkin pie. I'll never know, because even if it did, I wouldn't eat the filthy pig. Pigs sleep in root in feces. <laughs> That's a filthy animal. I don't want to eat nothing that ain't got enough sense to disregard its own feces. How about dogs? <laughs> dogs eat their own feces. I don't eat dog either. Yes, but do you consider <laughs> a dog to be a filthy animal? I wouldn't go far as to call a dog a filthy animal, but they're definitely dirty. But a dog's got personality, and personality goes a long way. So, by that rationale, if a pig had a better personality, he ceases to be a filthy animal. We'd have to be talking about one charming pig. It'd have to be the Cary Grant of pigs. <laughs> <laughs> I got rolling speed action. Uh, I'm Chase Crummett, and I'll be playing the part of Vincent. I'm Jamie Lynn Bishorner, and I will be playing Jules. Okay, now, tell me about the hash bars. What? So you want to know? Well, hash is legal there, right? Yeah, it's legal, but it ain't 100% legal. I mean, you can't walk into a restaurant, roll a joint, and start puffing away. You're only supposed to smoke in your home or certain designated places. Those are hash bars? Yeah, it breaks down like this. It's legal to buy it, it's legal to own it, and if you're the proprietor of a hash bar, it's legal to sell it. It's, it's legal to carry it, which doesn't really matter, because <laughs> get a load of this. If the cops stop you, it's illegal for them to search you. Searching you is a right that the cops in Amsterdam don't have. That did it, man. I'm fucking going. That's all there is to it. <laughs> You'll dig it the most, but... Y Damn it. <laughs> Screw you, Nima. All right. Um, <laughs> all right, uh, where were we? Uh, You'll dig it the most, but you know what the funniest thing about Europe is? What? It's the little differences. A lot of the same shit we got here, they got there. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs>